We all know that shorts are blowing up on YouTube, right? If you want to be growing on YouTube or growing your Twitch stream or growing your Twitch stream by posting shorts on YouTube and then sending that traffic to Twitch, you need to be creating shorts. Now, if you're streaming, what you're normally doing is at the end of your stream, you're going back, creating highlights or clips while you're streaming and then editing and then uploading to YouTube. Now, what if I told you guys with one click of a button, you can have a vertical video of the last 60 seconds of your gameplay ready to just upload to YouTube. You heard me right, it's a plugin for OBS and it's 100% free and we're gonna dive into it right now. So the first thing I want you guys to do is open up your browser and navigate to atom.tv. Yes, these guys are awesome. And what you're gonna do is on the top here, you're gonna see vertical plugin. You're gonna click that, it's gonna download a file right here. You install that with one click and then open OBS. Okay, I've opened up OBS and now you can see something is different. We have the vertical tab right here. You'll also notice right here we have vertical scenes and vertical sources right here. So what I'm gonna do is drag those down to where my normal scenes are and basically just create a second tab. I'm gonna do the same thing with sources. So now we have a vertical sources and a regular sources tab, same with my scenes. Make sure you're in the vertical scenes tab right here and let's create one called gameplay. And then let's create another one called full screen camera. And now let's go to the gameplay tab and under your vertical sources, what we're gonna do is first off, we're gonna add our gameplay. For me, we're gonna add a display capture. Boom, we have display capture. And what we're gonna do now is drag it so that it's the full size of the vertical short. And then I'm going to just transform, center horizontally. So now we know it's centered and we're gonna lock it. Then we're gonna add another source. We're gonna add our camera. So we're gonna hit my Canon DSLR and I'm gonna shrink this down to about right there. Perfect. And now I'm going to add my alerts. Boom, those will be right there. And then I'm going to lock that. I'm gonna bring this back over here. I'm gonna turn my display capture off in the vertical scene just so that it's not confusing to see. And what you're gonna do here is you can go into settings. So now these are the settings for your vertical canvas, right? It's 1080 by 1920, which is perfect. I set my video bitrate to 16,000 because we are doing obviously 1080p at 60 frames, audio bitrate at 320. Um, and you want to turn on backtrack. Now, backtracking runs while streaming and recording. What backtracking is, is it's basically a replay buffer. It's allowing this program to create a replay of something that happened in your stream. I have mine set to 120 seconds, but obviously if you're doing a short, you want it to set to 60 seconds. You choose your recording path and that is it. You could set a hotkey so that you could just hit a button on your keyboard. You can tie it into your stream deck. And what's gonna happen there is Basically, so I'm playing a game, something really cool just happened in the last 60 seconds. I got a crazy triple kill and you just hit this button right here, backtrack vertical clip. And what that's going to do is it's going to save a 60 second vertical video, just how you have it set up in the canvas and you can just upload it straight to YouTube. That's it. No editing, nothing like that. It, this is mind blowing and I cannot wait to use this. I'm going to use it for the first time on my stream tonight. Now. Obviously, you can see there's other buttons here. We have stream vertical and we have record vertical. If you want to do record vertical, let's say you just want to record a short uh, right here in OBS without doing any further editing whatsoever. You can do that as well by just recording with that button and then stream vertical. Yes, you guessed it. You know what that's for. If you're trying to stream to TikTok or Instagram, uh, you can now do that from here. You would just come into the settings, input the server and the stream key, and that's it. You're good to go. I mean, this is a really cool feature. I'm excited to use this, guys. Like, this is mind blowing to me that this is even a thing. So let's say, you know, you don't want to have a gameplay scene and you want to just have a scene where you're recording a short or just talking. You can come down here. Remember, we made a full screen camera scene. We're going to add another source, add my camera in. And now, since we want this to be the entire uh, scene, we are going to make this the entire that. Center it horizontally and bam, look at that. We have a beautiful vertical canvas ready to record a short, ready to stream whatever we want to do. I mean, this is really cool that this is in OBS now. I love this and I'm excited to use this tonight on my stream. Being able to just hit one button and have a short ready to upload. That's amazing. You could tie everything into it. I put my alerts in there. So obviously let's test an alert. 
they'll pop up right there over the gameplay it's gonna look great and i'm excited to use this it's gonna help with producing shorts right because shorts are what really are helping channels grow right now they have an insane amount of discoverability you could release a short and it could skyrocket to 10,000 views in the first five minutes if it's a good clip and that obviously gains your subscribers and also helps with everything with growing all of your channels shorts are an integral part of this right now guys and i think that this coming out right now uh, is the perfect timing because you all know that shorts just became monetized on YouTube, uh, which is a great thing for a lot of creators. There's a lot of creators out there who strictly do shorts. They don't do long form content. So this plugin is going to make that so much easier for everyone. Imagine you're just playing a game uh, and you have a stream deck or even just a hotkey on your keyboard and you want to create a short. Um, the amount of time that this is going to save by being able to just hit one button and have that vertical video saved directly to your PC. You can even start uploading while you're still streaming uh, to drive more traffic to your stream, which is probably what I'm going to do. And I suggest you guys do the same. So I'm very happy with this plugin. This is an awesome addition to OBS and I had to make a video on it because I wanted you guys to see what this was all about. But if you guys enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next time I post a video. And if you want to hang out with me live, I stream on Twitch at twitch.tv slash hammerdance. Link to that in the description below. But anyways, guys, that's all from me. I want you to keep those hammers up and I'll see you next time.